Hey guys, what is up everyone? I'm DCSK. Thanks for checking out my video. And I have a big news for everyone. The Mojang Studio and Double Eleven have revealed a new DLC for Minecraft Dungeon, The Flame of the Nether. I'm pretty surprising to see that this update is releasing so soon. It is on 24th of February 2021, just about 2 weeks to go. I am so excited and can't wait to play it. Are you excited for that too? Come, let's see what's new on the Nether DLC. It will have 6 new mission, new gold currency, new pickling merchant, new monster, new gears and artifact, 2 new skin, and a baby gas pad. And they are also bringing free updates to the game, who doesn't like free stuff? And that will be end game content. It introduced procedurally generated end game mission known as Ancient Hunt that weave through the nether. By defeating ancient monster and making it out alive, players can earn top tier gilded gear. Finally guys, an end game content. I did mention end game content update in my last video. You can check that out at right top here or down there at the description. It has 10 new features update you would like to see in the next update. And one of it is the end game content. So make sure to check that out. And the next one is some changes to Apocalypse Plus. What's the change? Reduce difficulty or there will be Apocalypse Plus 50? I don't know. So far they haven't revealed what's the change yet. So stay tuned for more. They have released an official artwork for the Flames of the Nether DLC. It is right behind me. I think we can find some clue on the new update in the artwork. Now uh, let's see um, on the left top a new monster. Looks like a flying spider to me. It is blazes. The blaze shoot 3 fireball at the players which will light them on fire. On the most left side it is a magma cube. A new monster, not sure how it works. Below the blazes it is with the skeleton. A new skeleton will run up to the player incredibly fast and hit them with their sword. It is presumed they will be able to inflict a wither effect. Beside wither skeleton, you can see there is two pickling. The jumping one is pickling with sword. The back one is armored pickling. Ooh, can you see this cute little hoggling? Not sure if they do attack or just neutral monster. Now on the right side here, you can see another pickling with crossbow. And at the back, you can see a pickling is waving at us. It is the new pickling merchant. I believe the new gold currency will use on him to buy some new good stuff. And beside the pickling merchant, there is this tiny little square thing. It is a new baby gas pad. It is purely cosmetic and does not attack enemy. At top of the pickling merchant, it is a big gas. Looks like a flying octopus to me. Not sure about its behavior. Let's see what else. Uh, at the back of this guy, he is holding the new web bow and wearing new pickling armor. The left one, I believe he is holding the new crossbow and wearing new crimson rope. The right one looks like he is holding a new huge ice cream bar to me. Not sure what is that new weapon and he is also wearing new web rope. And the front one, he is holding a new flaming sword and wearing new pickling armor. Alright, so far we can see 8 new monster, 1 new merchant, 1 new pet, 4 new armor and 4 new weapon on the artwork. And there is new nether warrior skin. Also they have released a teaser. Looks like he is walking down from the camp. Head west then head south. There you can see a cave entrance. Head in there, this cave looks spooky. I wonder what's inside here. Now look, a new glowing skeleton light armor. Not sure it is armor or skin. And they will introduce 6 new missions that will take players to the blazing nether. Possibly the new mission will be netherworld forest, warp forest, scorch cracks, dangerous delta, terrible fortress, and crimson grove. Wow, there will be even more new monster artifact gears and much more stuff to be revealed soon. So stay tuned for more. Do leave a comment below. What's your thought? Are you excited with the new DLC updates? I hope you enjoyed the video and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I am very appreciate. So happy hunting. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.